So you guys might know, Jailbreak is in fact updating tonight, and we are going to be getting a brand new Season 4, hopefully a bunch of new vehicles, a bunch of new spoilers, and a whole bunch of like crazy stuff, okay? So Asimo and like Bad CC, they've gone ahead and posted some sneak peeks over here on their Twitter. And we're gonna go ahead and take a look at all the uh, new things. So the first sneak peek that we have is from uh, the criminal team and we have the UFO, we have the movable uh, spoiler thing, and we have a giant orange parachute. And uh, if you guys watched my videos from a few days ago, then uh, you might have noticed that I went into this game to simulate a space station robbery because, you know, giant orange parachute is very, very reminiscent of a space shuttle, okay? See, orange parachute over here, orange parachute over here. Like, they're basically the same thing, except this over here is a car, and this over here is a giant space plane. And today, SC1 and Bad CC have released a new picture. They're actually adding a blue parachute as well. So uh, there's something very interesting going on with these parachutes. And also, we're getting rocket turbine spoilers. This is like a jet engine with afterburners or something like that. It looks absolutely sick. And we have like these three what look to be uh, rocket fins here. Yeah, these can only point to one thing. We are going to be getting some crazy aerospace themed robbery. They might release a, a sneak peek sometime later today about like a new robbery or something. But I'm pretty sure that the next jailbreak update that we are getting, we will get rockets, maybe like even advanced jet planes, and all sorts of like space robberies, okay? Because you know, a Simo and Bad CC, they always do robberies about every six months, okay? So they did one like, uh, I believe, Jewelry Store in like 2017, and then they did the uh, train in the December 2017, then the museum in June 2018, and then they, uh, I don't think add, they added any robbery uh, December, I think like in January they added, January 2019 that is, they added a, a passenger train, and then uh, June they added the power plant. So that only makes sense that in December, we should be getting the next big robbery. Now what could this robbery possibly be, you might be wondering? Well, you see here, it's probably going to be based something like off aerospace. Because you know, we have parachutes, we have jet engines, and we have rocket fins. And you know what else has parachutes, rocket fins, and uh, jet engines? Well, like not really jet engines, but you kind of get the point. A space shuttle, of course. So yeah, there's probably going to be a giant space shuttle launch pad in the middle of the desert that, you know, carries you up, like, way up over here outside of the atmosphere. You go up there and, uh, you know, just uh, rob a space station or something. If you watched my previous video, I have, like, a very, very detailed, like, way of, like, how the space station is going to work. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's exactly what the new robbery is going to be. It is going to be some form of crazy space station. Now here's the thing, December updates are always the biggest for Jailbreak, okay? Like last year they added the uh, seasons and the levels here, okay? And it's, so we got the Arachnid and the uh, Torpedo, which are like kind of the fastest cars inside of the game, well at least the Torpedo is. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna get probably a whole bunch of new vehicles as well. I would not be surprised if we could have our mini rocket, like a jet engine, rocket engine powered plane, rocket ship, spaceship, whatever you want to call it. That would be pretty epic, okay? Imagine if it was powered off of only rocket fuel, but it could go, like, supersonic across the map in, like, five seconds or something. <laughs> that would absolutely be ridiculous. So what I am going to be expecting probably is, uh, some form of, like, new game-changing feature. So, like, you know how last year we got levels? This year, we should get prestige, okay? So, like, literally every simulator, if you like, especially, like, Saber Simulator, I'm not sure about the uh, Ninja, like, number one game, Ninja Training Simulator, whatever that one's called as well. I believe both of them have Reborn slash Prestige feature. Basically, what that is, if you guys haven't played any uh, simulator games, is you essentially just, like, uh, get a certain amount of money. Then every time you get a certain amount of money, you have to start over, okay? You wipes all your vehicles, wipes all the, like, stuff like that, and you start over from level Z, like, like, literally, blank, fresh start, except you have a multiplier, okay? And the multiplier is gonna be, like, times two, times three, times four, something like that. 
And every time you reborn, the multiplier increases. It starts maybe like at 1, then it goes to 2, then 4, then 8, then 16, then 32, then 64, then 128, 256, 512, 10, 24, 20, 48, 40, 96, etc, etc, etc. And eventually you get up to like some crazy wacky numbers like 65,536 and then like 2.1 times 10 to the 9 or something like that. It's like absolute ridiculous multipliers. Then you get like billions and trillions of cash and jailbreak and like what seems to be a lot of money right now like 140 million it's gonna seem like puny like little newbie can get it okay yeah that's what prestige does it causes the crazy amount of inflation but let's be honest here jailbreak cash there's really nothing to do okay so if they added like prestige where you have to basically convert all your current cash into like some uh, higher like level cards that like uh, are immune to uh, the uh, prestige reborn whatever stuff that would be pretty cool and the other thing you can do with prestige is you can get like limited like weapons limited skins all sorts of stuff and maybe and actually this might not be completely like related to the uh, prestige imagine if every time you like level up like five or ten levels you get to rob one additional jewelry store box get 500 more bank cash get an additional museum item or something like that higher uranium multipliers like i don't know just like a boost in cash that would be pretty sick and eventually when you get to level 50 the uh, multiplier would be like double or triple or something like that and it would make grinding a lot faster i'm not sure if like that will create a lot of inflation instead of jailbreak but uh then the SIBO could release like 5 million cars 10 million cars and stuff like that and people shouldn't really have too much problems getting those and another thing I should probably point out is that the double XP game pass is going to be going away. So if you guys want it, literally when this video would like releases, buy it now. Okay, like literally just like on the day of this video comes out, if you are watching it, buy the game pass. It's 140 Robux. Do whatever it takes to get 140 Robux. I might be like uh, streaming later today as well. So uh, make sure you guys uh, just like go on the stream. I might give out a crap ton of Robux on the stream so yeah make sure you guys have a notification subscribe like all that good stuff so you uh, don't miss out on this uh, chance to win the game pass that will soon go away it's eventually gonna become like a season pass it's like every time the new season starts you are gonna have to buy it again which honestly uh, I obviously prefer the uh, lifetime double XP I basically covered a lot of like what we should expect in the uh, December update but what about the update that's literally coming out tonight well, I mostly covered it in my uh, previous video, but like basically it's just like a whole bunch of uh, new uh, spoilers here. I don't think we are getting any new vehicles. This vehicle over here is, I believe, uh, if I come over here, spawn it real quick. It looks like very close to the Porsche. Okay, so if I come over here, look in the back, you can see this back over here matches exactly with that back. Okay, just a different color, different map. Oh yeah, we do have a fall themed map coming as well. And also, these parachutes, man, I don't know, like, if they're gonna obstruct your view, if they're, like, gonna block the uh, guns or something like that. Imagine if the parachute could stop bullets. That would be absolutely bonkers, okay? Like, shotgun would be completely useless. But the good news is, if you have the uh, parachute deploy and it does uh, protect you against from, um, like, uh, explosions, damage, bullets, whatever, when people try to missile you... You block of that parachute and then like it don't go through okay that that would be pretty awesome okay see well please do that because you know whenever we stream people always go like get their army helicopter and go boom bam boom whatever on the uh bacon hairs and creek crafts and everything anyway let's go ahead and just uh, i don't know goof around here how to get xp fast if you are not already level 50 yet either uh, come over here and buy it or just like uh come rob the train do all sorts of other stuff okay i don't know why the train not giving me any money and uh, yeah so i kind of wish the simo brought back the uh, robbing multiple train cars feature because with that feature you can basically like get i don't know it was like 1500 to 2000 xp per train because there will be like six or seven red cars on it <laughs> And you get like 200 or 300 per each robbery. It was absolutely ridiculous. And uh, yeah, so you could get like an insane amount of money. Asimo, please bring that back. I highly doubt he will, but who cares? We all want it back. Am I right? I mean, whatever it takes to get a lot amount of XP really, really quick, we'll do that. Okay, and also buy the first like 20 or so levels. Those are like dirt cheap, okay? Because for the price of the first 20, it can like, it costs like, I don't know. 
one of the level 30s or 40 something like that okay so make sure you guys the day the update comes out go on criminal team buy the first 20 go on police team buy the first 20 it's only going to be like a total of 200k cash in game maybe at most but uh yeah it's uh, not going to be like the worst okay because like i believe level 49 and 50 are like up into the 500,000 or something so I'm pretty sure that's basically all I have to cover for Season 4, the next Jailbreak update, the big December one. That's usually when all the crazy stuff happens. Please, Azimo, give us another crazy December update because this one, honestly, I was expecting new vehicles, but I don't think we're getting any new vehicles. Don't think we're getting any new robberies with this update as well. And uh, yeah, so basically Season 2 is kind of like Season 4. Azimo said it was going to be better than Season 3, but um... There's no new vehicles, and we kind of want things faster than the torpedo, faster than the volt bike, because it's been a while, okay? It's been almost a year, 11 months or something like that, okay? So I guess that's basically it for this uh, update of, uh, like, what's gonna happen, interesting stuff, what to expect the next update or something. If you guys enjoyed it, so you guys know exactly what to do, hit like, comment, subscribe. If you guys want to, like, uh, get the uh, double XP game pass, I'm going to be giving away some Robux on my stream later today. And uh, yeah, I'll be streaming before the update. Make sure you guys have uh, the notifications turned on so you guys don't miss that. If you guys want to like, uh, you know, know everything there is about the new jailbreak update. Make sure you guys press like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.